All right, who's ready to make a Reese's peanut butter cup pie? Nine inch pie and a white chocolate. Stay tuned, we'll do it right now. All right, Reese's saw online where Hershey's put out a beautiful peanut butter cup pie, but it had a limited quality. I went to order it, sold out. I mean, it sold out immediately within an hours probably. But anyway, after I saw it, I said, I got to have one. Well, I went ahead and figured out all the ingredients we need and instructions how to make it. And I'm going to use something a little bit different. We're going to use white chocolate. Now, white chocolate is made from cocoa butter versus cocoa solids. And some people say it's not real chocolate, but legally it is. It's a little bit harder to work with, but I think we'll be all right. Let's go ahead and get started. I'll show you everything together here. All right, I got everything you need here. We got four ounces of butter, nice and soft butter. We got 22 ounces of smooth peanut butter. We got 22 ounces of powdered sugar right there. And we got 26 ounces of chocolate, which we're getting ready to melt in our double boiler right here. Now, we also need a pie pan here. And it's, uh, it's actually a special pan. It's got the removable bottom on here. So as, as we put the chocolate in, we'll be able to pop it out, cool that down, and be able to come back in and install it. We'll show you that in just a minute. And we got a mixer. Then that should be everything we need to get started. So let's go ahead and get started with the double boiler melting our chocolate right now. All right, while our chocolate's melting, we're going to go ahead and mix our ingredients for the center portion of this chocolate. This uh, the peanut butter in the middle. Oh man, this is going to be so good. I can't wait. Let's get it all in here. Get it all out of here. All right, here we go. We're getting there. That's going to be, uh, I hope we're not on a diet, because this is not diet food. All right, let's get all of it in here we can. We don't want to waste any peanut butter here. Get it all out of here. All right, we got that in. Now get our butter. And we're going to put this on our blender and uh, get it mixed up here in just a second. All right, here we go. All right, are y'all ready? Let's get this locked in here. All right, let's see how we're doing here. Are we ready? Nice and slow. Oh, it's looking good. It's going to take us a few minutes, so uh, stay tuned. We'll get this mixed in here, and I'll show you what it looks like once we get everything mixed together. This will be the filling, the peanut butter filling for the pie. Stay tuned. All right, we got our melted chocolate here. We are ready to go ahead and put the first layer in this pan right here, all the way around it. And come up on the sides of it here. Once we get over here, we'll come up on the side here a little bit. Get it all in the whole bottom. And then we're going to let it cool down. What we'll do after we do this, we'll cool it down in the refrigerator and let it... Uh, and let it get hard so we can come back and we'll go to step two. All right, stay tuned. We're going to go ahead and get this all the way up here, all the way around. All right, it's looking good. We got our white chocolate completely covered around this entire pan here. And what we do now is we'll go set this in the fridge, let it get hard, and then we're going to pull it out and go to step two. All right, let's go ahead and get in the refrigerator and get it hard. Here we go. All right, about 30 minutes in the fridge. I think we're ready. Let's see if this thing will come out of here. Look at that. That is looking good. We're going to flip it over here and take this bottom off. We may have to work on this just a little bit because sometimes the chocolate will go over and kind of hold the paper in. So we're going to slowly pop this off here around the edges so the paper will come out. Slowly, slowly here. Kind of get out and kind of come down over top of it and hold it in just a little bit. And we're gonna get it. See, it's got a little catch right there. It's catching a little bit. Not quite yet. Oh, there's coming. It's coming out. Coming loose. A couple of minutes we're gonna have it. All right, here we go. A big piece over here. Hold it. There we go. We got it now. Here we go. We're getting there. And we are done, I think. Yeah, 
and it is off. Look at this. We have the makings of a Reese's peanut butter cup pie. And what I'm going to do now, I'm going to clean all this edge up right here. And uh, we're going to the next step. Stay tuned. I'm going to work on this just for a few minutes. And I'll be get right back to you. All right, there it is. All cleaned up and ready. Phase one done here. Now we're going to move on to phase two here. Let's get this one to the side. We're going to go ahead and put our pan back together here. Get one piece out of it there. Because then what we're going to do is put our peanut butter filling in here. Get it nice and, nice and firm where it's about the right shape so we can put it in the pie. All right, here we go. All right, here's our filling. What we're going to do now is we're going to mash this down and fill the whole pie pan up. Because what we're going to do is put this back in here and then put this in there for the filling. This is the filling for it right here. And we are going to get it nice and smooth. We're going to take a little pressure to get it all pushed together. Then we'll pop it out. Get as smooth as we can here. I think we got it. I think we're getting pretty close now. All right, y'all ready? Take this out. I think we're just about ready. All right, hopefully it's gonna come out here. Okay. What we'll do now is we're gonna trim this up a little bit around the edges and we're gonna end up putting the pie, the chocolate back here and put this in the pie. Stay tuned. And we're there. Okay. Now we want to take this off. Come on off there. Here we go. It's coming. Oh, that's me on the inside. That's our filling right there. I'm going to set it over here. Next what we're going to do is we're going to get this pan back out again here. And put the uh, pan back together and put the chocolate back in the pan. Clean it all out here so we don't have people on the outside. Of course, it's not going to hurt anything. It tastes good outside as it does inside. Put this back together. We're going to take and put our back in here. Then we're going to take our filling and set it in here. Oh, this is looking good. Holy smoke, this is going to be so good. All right. We're getting close now. We can gently push this down. Getting ready to put our layer of chocolate on top of here for our final phase here. All right, stay tuned. We'll get together and we'll be putting the chocolate in here in just a second. All right, everybody, it's ready for the final coat of chocolate on the top here. Let's get it on here. Oh, this is going to be so good. Let's move it around here. Okay, now we got to smooth this up. And how we're going to do that is we're going to use a ruler. Y'all could, you could just get one, uh, a brand new one, and just use it. But what I got here is a one that I coated with with a, um, some aluminum foil. This is kind of. Let me go one more time across here. I think it's be pretty smooth here. All right, I think we can live with that. Once it pops out, once we cool this down and pop it, we were to clean these edges out, and it's going to be beautiful. All right, let's go ahead and put this back in the refrigerator, let it harden, we'll pop it out, and get a slice off. Stay tuned. All right, here we have the final product. Let's see if we can get this thing apart now. Oh, that's looking nice. Oh, got looking good. We have a beautiful white chocolate Reese's Peanut Butter Cup Pie. Look at that. Is that beautiful or what? I'm going to clean up the edges just a little bit, but I tell you what, that is looking good. Might clean up the edges just a little bit, but it looks good just like it is, really. I tell you what, who wants to make a nice cut on that thing? Let's cut a piece off of that. All right, everybody, we have a nice slice of a Reese's peanut butter white chocolate pie. I love it. Oh, my God. That is good. That turned out... Mmm. Oh my God, that is very good. If y'all want to make one, it's excellent. One thing that I would recommend, I had it in the refrigerator letting it get hard. 
and I took it out and tried to cut it. It tried to crack a little bit. What you want to do is let it get to room temperature. It does not need to be refrigerated, and it will cut through real easy then. Oh my gosh. Mmm. Got one bite. All right, I appreciate everybody coming along in this little adventure. Don't forget to click like, comment, blow, share. Subscribe to Gigmaster and make it a nice pie. I'll see you on the next adventure.